Welcome back to Breath Edge. It's Johnny J. Appleseed here. And in the last episode, we unlocked a very strange biomodule that contains some sort of radiation reducing liquid, as well as launching some cow substitute devices or creatures at some unknown planet. Fun and games! <laughs> uh, what the heck? Any case, let's have something to eat, something to drink, items, resources, there we go. Place these reports down. So there. I mean, I've got nothing else to do with them. That's the chicken thing. There we go. And as you can see, posters and displays are still good. So I don't know what it was, but for some reason it's working. Yeah. It's, you can't actually interact with that. Menu, help, call, edit, exit, generate a stable. ASCII art. Reboot, yes, no. Okay. Couldn't see that before. Alright, so we got some oxygen candles, we got some water on us. Lots of resources. I'm just going to take that fuel as well. I am not going to eat, drink the hamster in the smoothie container, but I am going to put it down somewhere. Where shall we put this? Uh, it looks like as good a place as... Oh dear, it's fallen over. <laughs> hamster smoothie. No, that's just going to keep falling over. That's no good. Alright. Back in the suitcase you go. Alright, so I'm still pretty good for tools. And that's about a finish researching. Titanium electronics refined metal blaster. Well um I think we need to get the blaster because we have to go and investigate that area where we died to the security bots. The reason why we have to do that is um, there's markers there we need to investigate and I mean it's going to lead to unlocking things like more uh, radiation protection and all that kind of stuff. And we can research like the vehicles as well. I don't know what lycoplasma is. don't know how to get that. Chewing gum. 
stopping leaks and interlocutors. I got resin. Let's do that quickly. Wonder. Start research three minutes. Okay. Um, what was it? Okay, so we've been around that side. This is our space station. Gonna disable the Normandy markers for now because we don't really need that. Spaceship debris, oxygen stations. These are the ones that's out on the other side. Out that way. Don't need those markers right now. Just clean things up a little bit. Okay, so we've got to go uh, visit all of these markers because we need to investigate that spaceship debris. It's an area with oxygen. I'll make that blue. Yeah. Mounted oxygen stations. Actually, we'll make that blue as well. Mounted oxygen station. Because that's also. That air engineering shuttle can be blue as well, because that's also got oxygen. Okay. That's a little better. Forty five seconds. What else is there that we can do? Two generators, two compensators, four electronics. There. I only got two electronics, so that's not going to work. Enhanced flashlight. Yeah, just need resin to make bubble gum or chewing gum rather. EMP grenades, beef grenades, enhanced handy scrap. I think I'm going to get one of this refined metal and titanium. Titanium and refined metal. that a go in a moment. Okay, lots of cans of beef. Synthetic beef from a synthetic tech house. Sometimes it's better to blow it up than to eat it. Product is famous for its disgusting tastes, side effects, and explosiveness. It's the favorite food of green universe radicals, after broccoli, of course. Interesting. <laughs> okay. 
Four titanium, four electronics, four refined metal. So we're going to have to get some more electronics. That sounds like a reason to go exploring. I think what I'll do is I'll take you with, drop some of you. Water, food, oxygen, fuel, first aid. Okay, off we go. Uh, what was the number two here? Oh, uh, that was the drill. Number four was that. Okay. And here we go. I get 20 durability for one durability of the repair tool. Maybe shouldn't have uh, done that last one there. Alright, good to go. One six one four two one thousand Let's go look see Where's that the other place that has the robots? I don't remember. Either way, we'll see if we can get some materials here. Short on electronics. That's an interesting looking section there. Yeah, that's got a turret. Yeah, there's two turrets there. Let's hit down here. This is an interesting looking section. Whatever will we find here? A very competent pipeline distribution. Ooh, okay. Oh, there's some metal. Yes, I'm aware. Now, sit on the thing, then scan it. See a bit of debris poking out there. Mm, what is that? Looks like molten rock.
What a strange place. But maybe we can find something useful here. Let's open on the other side. It's worth noting this that the robot gatekeepers can't be in the service, and therefore their involvement in the ranks of the armed forces is extremely improbable. Looks like some alcohol got spilled over its circuits in the crash. We can scan that. Big TV. Grab a tool. Do I have a grab a tool? I don't have a grab a tool. Okay, so don't touch the glass. Then again, I don't need the glass for anything right now. Although, fabric. Get, oop, that's a anti asteroid turret. Turret detected. <laughs> turret is switched off. Nice. Okay, we we'll get a look at the turret, which seems to be just some sort of radio transmitter. Don't have the ability to scan it by the looks of things. going on here? That's goo. Oh, that looks really hot. Oops. And there's actually flaming sections there. There's another turret there. Is this a shuttle? Looks like a shuttle. Speakers Damaged one. Shuttle. Ripped out and connected with the help of a cheap extension cord. Pleasure shuttle. <laughs> Speaker blueprint. Looks like he was trying to attract attention by playing loudly on his guitar. His acoustic guitar. And using a speaker. In space. <laughs> There's more food, water, silver sun. Oh. I'll grab that. Handy scrapper required. Plastic. Love the skull motive. Looks like a proper rocket. Well, at least he went out doing what he loves. It's 
like some kind of vending machine. Not the smartest tool in the shed, but then, yeah. Okay. to get behind that turret. Can I go here? Oh, this place is chock-a-block full of these turrets. There's something very bright and flashy over there. shuttle ahead. I wonder how you find everything so quickly. Is it because of my hints? Turret signal. Be careful. Switch that one off. Awesome. There's some resources around here. short on ice at the moment. Get some more, because that's water for me. Okay. More electronics. many electronics as I can get because I need to make those, those I need to do those research what do we have here this is more titanium yes more titanium I think we're fine for titanium for the moment it's a piece of hull of something motorcycle or jet vacuum cycle or whatever you want to call it so many little things to collect there this seems to have oxygen in it That's a familiar way of repairing things. Did you study the same manual as well? <laughs> Pink underpants. Bunny loves mommy. Wow. Interesting. Ah, inventory's full. I hope this underwear doesn't belong to him, although I still wouldn't touch it. <laughs> <laughs> ok, 
Okay. Water. What else is there? All right, space car postcard with a photo of the first space car launched into space. The photo was taken not so long ago. My famous traveller, Max. Up to this moment, it, it was believed this car was drawn by the gravity of some planet and destroyed. I wonder what car that could be. <laughs> it's unlikely a certain that it will fly with electric engine, vehicle. The design of the steering wheel is quite interesting. Okay, so let's scan the steering wheel. Enhanced handy scrapper. Okay, already learned that blueprint. So you can research it or you could pick it up like that. Good to know. Cardboard boxes, bottles of water. Less storage in this one by the looks of things. Plenty of oxygen still. What is that over there? Have I been there? There's that icon to the left there as well. Need to go and visit. Don't seem to be getting any pings off of this. Ooh, boxes. Can't bash that one. Breath edge. Fabric plastic. More plastic. Refined metal. Construction toolkits. I'll take some water so I can pick that up. Nutrient packs. Oh, alcohol. Take some oxygen soon. Got enough water, I can drop the ice for now. Okay. 
got the alcohol. Yeah, that's also water. No electronics around here. Nope, doesn't look like it. Okay, let's see if we can head off to that other marker quickly. What have we here? It's a really big roll of rubber tape. Okay. Take it we need to scan this. Three out of four. And a handy little oxygen station. nothing to hide but you will make little kids cry and people may think what a nasty lad when your bottom will glow with rad shame on you when your underpants show through stay alert ripped pants can make you hurt brought to you by Captain Ramius Development of space industry allowed humanity to spread the universe earlier. It was possible only for trained professionals to travel to Earth's orbit. Now even a child can go on intergalactic flight on an intergalactic flight. This leads to various disasters each year due to negligence and carelessness. Despite the abundance of training materials and the widespread promotion of safety in space. Monitoring the condition of a working suit is a necessity and is especially relevant in space. Okay, uh, my scan is also done for. So I need to go make another one. It's pretty cool to learn these boxes. Or at least, not yet. Why is this all upside down? Floral pattern saucer. Can't take that right now. That. Have I been there? Yeah, I think I have. Big old communication dishes by the looks of things. More electronics. Hmm. I do remember, I do remember being here, although I don't know if I recorded it. Ah, it looks pretty nasty. Pretty bad. Let's neutralize. Zip. Wow, okay. Don't know what's going on there. Fuck. 
photo of the liner. Seems that during one of the stops someone flew out of the line and took a picture of it at quite a distance. Hmm. A fire extinguisher. First aid kit. What to do, what to do. Let's take one of those. First aid kits always come in handy. Really is suspicious because you either burn something and blow up the entire oxygen ship or not, and you have nothing to extinguish in this case, although such cases do happen. <laughs> I'll leave that for now. Interact with over here. Nope. Okay. Lots of resources to pick up here. Where is that? Vacuum cleaner blueprint. I don't want to take that. Oh, I need to use some oxygen anyway. Motorcycle blueprint stained with blood, but some of the design ideas are distinctly worth attention. Patched underpants. A real engineer can repair even their underwear. <laughs> Okay, so I don't think I have actually been here. This is quite an interesting area. Looks like it was part of the main body of the, the liner. Oh, there's something over here. Another shuttle. Oh, there's a toilet. Although this one seems to be less than working. Dispenser blueprint. Tomb, tomb Raider. That's the cartridge. Nice little pin-up poster. That's a different suit, maybe that's one of the electrician or the engineer's suits. That's an oxygen. Need the scanner to use that. Engineers pass. Universal pass on magnetic strip and a hole for a string. It is impossible to forget it or assemble it in the processor. It's issued only to employees of the liner. The pass gets demagnetized after some time and you need to use your personal password to activate it again. Without the password, the universal pass becomes universal trash with a magnetic strip and a hole for a string. Why does that look like the picture was substituted <laughs> with a bit of rubber tape? Victor Tinkerman. That I kind of want to take. Um, I'm going to drop the plane.
plastic. I've got plenty of plastic. Let's take that. Might come in handy later. That looks like a that yeah, that sounds like it might come in very handy later. The calendar page, Cosmonautics Day is celebrated in April, so I guess this image is timed to coincide with this day. Looks like twelfth of April. Which is a couple of days away, five days away, at uh, the date of this recording. Alright, and it looks like there is... some electronics at the top here. Lots more electronics around you by the looks of things. Lots of stuff to collect as well. Going to have to make a trip back here. Hoping I can get through here though. A section of the liner appears to have merged with the rock. Yeah, there's my space station. Who knew? It was so close by. What's that down there? Oh, the front of this thing is all smashed up. Suitcase with wheels. I'm gonna leave that for now. Sky seems reasonably intact. Have I been here before? Honey, yes, I think I have. I remember this barrel of honey. going to unceremoniously drop here in the corner for now. That I'll put up, however. There we go. Make it look a bit more homely. Again, here we go. In the blaster. Two refined metal, four titanium. Thank you. 
Okay. Professional tool for scraping off. Okay, we read that one before. Let's research the blaster. Ten minutes. Ready. That can go in there. That can go there. Construction kits. Alcohol. Fabric. Right. Well, that was a nice little jaunt around the area. So we've cleared off some of the markers. Discharge cell. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to disable that. Engineering shell that we found. A blue. <coughs> Right, so we still got to visit that spaceship debris, the spacesuit markers, more spaceship debris. Yep, yeah, doing pretty good. Okay, I'm going to call it there. Thank you very much for watching. Clap that like button, move that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys next time.